Hello guys, sorry for the bad angle. Okay, hello, hello. Hi, Clady. Hi, Connie. Hola, hola. Hello, guys. Welcome back to another cooking video with Jesse, with me. Um, don't mind the hair and the, my makeup is already like wearing off, but the hair, I'm going to take a shower today, probably to tomorrow morning I don't know we'll see um but I put a hair oil on my hair so yeah so I just got back well a little bit ago from Walmart I went uh, like to go shop for some other stuff I needed um I want to go buy more of the detox tea that I mentioned on one of my videos because I'm like basically running out of it. I think I have enough for like two more days, maybe, maybe three. So um, this is like $5, I believe. So yeah. Hi, um, Sophie. Hi, Pauline. Hi, Mary. Welcome, guys. So, I hope you guys are having a good Wednesday. Um, my day was all right um, at first, and then I don't know. I started kind of getting a headache. You know how they say that when someone's not feeling good, like other people, like they're not feeling good or whatever, their energy or whatever, like it affects you. I don't even know if it was that or in general, I just started feeling sick. But anyways, don't forget to go subscribe guys, give this video a thumbs up, and don't forget to share, and guys, we're getting closer to those 7,000 subscribers, let's get there guys, let's get there, I hope soon, so anyways, I thought, hmm, what should I make for dinner, and I saw the chorizo, and my mom might need it, but I'm only making like maybe half of it, just a tiny bit. And I thought about, and then I saw some flour tortillas that my mom has here. So um, I thought about making some scrambled eggs and some chorizo. So in case you guys don't know how to do that, it's pretty easy. I always show you guys stuff that is pretty easy. And that you don't really have to prepare too much for it. So anyways, let's begin. I'm going to start by cutting the chorizo. And I don't know if you guys want to see this though. Let me back up the camera. The blueberry yogi tea is delicious. Okay. Yes, you should. Yes. I got the tea at Walmart. I haven't seen it anywhere else. Well, I haven't really checked. Oh, I think someone gave this cup to my mom. It says happy birthday, but it's, it's not her birthday. Anyways, let's start cutting. Okay, so... Ah. 
Okay, so I'm only going to use about that much. Let's um, turn, I'm going to use this tiny pan, so I'm going to turn it on, hello it's so funny you're making this right now and it's totally a breakfast food but I love chorizo so I understand. Well I mean eggs don't really have to be just breakfast guys, eggs can be every day. Um, us Mexicans, that's what we make, a boiled egg and then some beans. No, I do not add potatoes, but, um, no, okay, I don't really like onions, guys. I know, that's kind of like weird of me well not really weird but like I know not a lot of people okay I'm going to put some like probably that much um I don't really like onions and my mom gets mad at me because she'll add onions to to um to the food and I just I hate it I mean if I if I don't see them, obviously, you know, my mind or whatever, I won't get grossed out. Hey, Jesse, how are you? Hi, Sophie. I've been good. Haven't talked to you in forever. I feel you. I hate onions, too. Yes. Hi, Jesse. Just saw your morning video. Glad you're live now. Happy holidays. Hi, uh, Jason from New Jersey. Well, thank you. Okay, I'm going to put the camera down here. I'm sorry if I'm like moving the phone around too much. So, I'm taking it out. Yeah, so I'm not much of an onion person, even though onion and garlic is good for you. I just, I hate it. But like I said, if I don't see it, it won't really like gross me out. I'll still eat it like in, in tacos, in like Mexican tacos, I'll eat it. Okay. I apologize again, guys. See, the pan is over there, so I'm going to leave you guys right here. Let me just zoom you guys a tiny bit. So I'm going to get a fork. And I hope you guys can see.
gosh. I hate, I hate that it, it jumps. And like, since it's frying, it's like, you make a big mess on the stove. Uh, you need to move the camera down just a little bit. And a while. What are you cooking today? What well, it says in the title, girl. Um, that's why I named the title by what I'm making. Um, eggs and chorizo. You need to buy a splatter card. What is it? What's a splatter whatever thing? Yes, it splashes everywhere. Hola, Maria. Okay, I'm going to face the camera the other way. Yeah, see how the stove is? That's so why my mom hates cooking. Like, when food, like, splatters all over the place. Or well, mainly, like, you know, the oil. And chorizo, it's already salty, so I'm not really going to add any salt. It, but let me just turn it down a tiny bit more. I just wear a long sleeve so it won't splash. Yeah, I'm wearing long sleeves though. Um, wish I could smell, it looks delicious. Well, if you've ever had chorizo, you kind of can imagine how it smells. Okay, I should look into it. Clean. So how's your guys' um, day going? I need one of those blood guards. I never heard of them before. Yeah, me neither. Okay, this is kind of sticking. So just keep moving it. I'm tired of cleaning oil for my stove. Yeah, my mom hates it too. Okay, I'm turning it down a tiny bit more. Oops. Sorry guys, sorry, sorry. Okay, I'm going to get Okay, I'm going to get a, a bowl of this. Turn them on. And I'm doing three eggs. Oops. 
I could maybe just do two, but um, in case my mom wants want some. And then I am going to add just a tiny bit of salt. Just like, like that much. Get another fork and bat it around. Um, basically done with the chorizo. I, mean, I don't know if you guys can even see this, but I'm going to um, get some of the fat out. Okay, sorry guys, this is like, my videos are always all over the place, but okay, I'm going to put this in there now. Turn up the heat just a tiny bit more, and I have the hot water going on because, um... I don't want the the oil that I put on the you know to um, clog the drain. So just let it sit there for a little bit. And hello from Austin, Texas. Hola, cómo están? Yes, it will be good. Hi, Roni Garza. For flutter, fluffier eggs, I heard you can add a little bit of milk. Huh, that's weird. Okay, let's turn off the faucet. I think that's, that's good enough. Hola, saludos desde San Antonio, Texas. Hola, Mayela, saludos. Saludos a todos que um, son nuevos. Ojalá que se suscriben a mi canal para que sean parte de la familia Mariposa. So for those who are new, um, hello. I hope you guys subscribe to my channel and be part of the butterfly family so how many of you guys ate dinner already like it's 9.08 and I'm barely eating but it's okay I just I know you, sometimes you're not supposed to eat 
that late, but I I still do. I, I'm still not even that super hungry. Okay, I'll let it sit for a tiny bit. I ate pozole. Oh my gosh, I let lucky. I want pozole. I live in New Mexico. Same time here. Oh, nice, Maxine. I've never been to New Mexico. I had some brown rice and chicken ginger stir fry. Huh, interesting. Se ve riquísimo. Si, sí, gracias, Mayela. Hablas inglés, Mayela? Hi, the Yen Yen. Okay. Hello. Let me. You guys can't even see the pan, but yeah, I know some people don't really eat dinner, or they instead of eating like um, food, food they eat more of like a snack. Sometimes I'll eat just a snack, depending like if I eat a lot during the day then I'll eat more like a snack at night especially if it's already like super late uh, at night so let me show you guys there it is um, am I even showing it? I think so. Okay, I'm going to turn it off. Oh, and let me zoom you guys out just a bit. Okay. Sorry guys, I'm like above the the lighting so I'm going to make my tea instead of well I'm going to make it now and maybe drink it um, those eggs look good with some frijoles and chiles curtidos what is curtidos Cindy Chorizo and eggs are coming out delicious. Thank you. Did your therapy go well? Um, there's no date that uh, my therapy, there's no drama involved. So it went all right. Okay, I'm going to turn on, turn on El Comal. You know, the, the pan where you warm up las tortillas. I hadn't really had, um, what is it called? Chorizo with eggs. How, how's your new job going? My job is going, it's going good guys. Um, I'm learning a lot more stuff, you know, um, I'm getting a lot better. I don't ask for help as much. 
I just never realized how complicated it is that when like people order something um, and they say, oh, no pickles, but add this, but substitute that and do it. I want the fries well done and I want this like medium rare or whatever. It's like you want to put it down as the customer's tell you you know because you want the customers to be happy uh, and oh my gosh the other day this lady comes and um okay okay this lady comes and she was like all upset and was complaining and I I guess like hold on oops oh, shoot okay sorry guys I guess she was asking for something but she was like in a way asking for the wrong stuff like for the, she said a chicken sandwich or chicken something. I don't know if the camera is kind of dirty, guys. Sorry if it is. Um, and the manager was like, you're probably asking for a um, McChicken. And she's like, oh, well, you know, when I, in another town of, of ours close to us, um, she's like, well, when I go there, I never have any problems, and you guys put, or it had this and this, and from what she was describing it, you know, um, she, she didn't even know really how, like, what she was even asking. Okay, I'm going to put the tortilla in the comal. Um, but yeah, I had zucchini noodles and grilled shrimp for dinner. Now I'm gonna make some, some coffee. Uh, I want coffee, but my, um, my heart has been racing all day and coffee makes my, um, my heart accelerate so yeah so let me put you guys down oh my hand gets tired of like holding it sorry guys i don't know what i'm even watching on tv um customers can be very rude especially during the holidays yeah they can be, I've, I've gotten some rude hot customers guys and let me go turn the tortilla so it doesn't burn. But yeah, like I've gotten some rude customers like you know, you're supposed to repeat stuff back to them. Um, I, I, I never really repeat their order back unless they order something like really like big, like a big order. Um, but when I do, it's like they, by their turn of, tone of their voice, they're like, well, yeah. I'm like, okay, well, excuse me, you know, I'm, I'm, I mean, I don't tell them that, but I'm like, you know, I'm just trying to do my my job here and some customers It's like Okay, I check out the tortilla Ooh, And it's hot 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 um, But it's like if you want You know you want the custom how do I say this? You confirm with them, and then either way, if you confirm with them, they get mad at you, and 
if the order doesn't come out the way they want it, um, they end up either way getting mad at you. So I'm like, okay. They get their own order wrong and make us seem like we want make the mistakes. Yeah. Um, Arlette, do you work at McDonald's or what do you work at? I wish I could work somewhere and not have to deal with customers. Okay, girl. Yes, true. Um, okay, let me put the egg in the in the tortilla. Um either way, like even if we we are YouTubers, you know, influencers, we still have to deal with um people being negative and like bully us. Okay, so I I put See, good thing I made three because I probably only have enough for like one more. And what I like putting is, oh, I wonder if my mom has some avocado. Let me check. Nope, no avocado, but let me wash this knife so I can cut some jalapeno. Since the chorizo is like, you know, raw, you don't want to get sick or anything. Okay, so I'm going to cut some, some of this jalapeno in here that's probably enough and then I don't really know how to fold this There you go. I don't even know. Oh, there you guys go. It's all done. Okay. Um. So yeah. So my job is going all right, guys. I mean, we're never going to be fully satisfied with our work. Okay, for now, I'm just going to drink this, uh, it's like, uh, sparkling water, but it's, like, flavor. This is by the brand Clear American Ice Peach Nectar. That's the one. So, sorry if I'm not getting to all your guys' comments. I'm like scrolling up and reading some of your guys' comments. So, mm -mm -mm. so yeah, me too. Hope those drinks are so yummy. Yes, there's some, there's like a crisp apple one that I really like. Feliz Navidad and Happy New Year's. Hope brings love. Thank you. 
Thank you. Um, sorry, I'm like so blind. Annie, would you do a blog on job? Well, I can't really do a blog. I know, girl, you've been asking for like a video. I am updating you guys right here, so I hope that's good enough. There's, I already basically said everything I needed to say. Hello, Lori. Sorry, guys. I'm like over here eating. Where is your brother? All I'll say is he doesn't live with us. So, yeah. Um, anyways. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, enjoying this video. Um, I know you guys, I know I'm going to keep saying this. I know you guys enjoy this live video because you guys can communicate or like we can talk to each other and I can answer some of your guys' questions in here at the same time. So it feels like if you guys are it feels like you guys are here with me and it probably feels like you know I'm there with you guys but yeah it's like even if you guys already know how to cook or make whatever food I am making it's always good to just talk to you guys and like maybe we all do it differently you know like someone said um, if I add potatoes on it and it would be a good idea but it would probably take longer because you know they're hard and they have to oh, cook and actually my mom had some leftover potatoes from some enchiladas that she made which I didn't even end up eating enchiladas so yeah I'm allergic to wevels really Kurtz that sucks. Love you. Stay doing you, girl. Thank you. Um, how are you? I'm good, Kurt. Thank you, Maxine. Hello. Oh, well, same. Um... Thank you, Lori. You're amazing too. And I'm sorry, Janet, if I'm making you hungry. What is your plans for Christmas? You are looking good. Thank you. And I'm just going to answer this question and then I'll end this blog. Or, yeah, I guess you could call it like a blog. Um, I'm not really sure what I'm doing for Christmas. Um, I do have to work for, me and my mom have to work on Christmas Eve. Yeah, Christmas Eve. Um, my mom said that she was going to make some pozole, so I want Christmas to come already because I love pozole. That's one of my favorite foods is pozole. Um, and we'll probably just be here home alone. Um, my aunt, who we usually go to their house, um, they're going to go to Mexico a couple, like, probably three days before Christmas. So, yeah. And my dad's moving, so I don't, I won't be able to see my dad, but I get to see him tomorrow. Um, yeah. It'd just be me and my mom, probably, because I think another aunt of mine is going to Mexico, so, um, but yeah, I love you guys, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to be you, 
that and don't let anyone tell you any or make you feel any different and yeah um we love you uh we love i love you guys too and um again i uh i apologize if i, I can't do any more block miss i kind of ended it at day nine so yeah but you guys are so understanding and that's why i love you guys so yeah have a good night and i'll talk to you guys soon bye guys